Hi everybody, thanks for joining me today. Um, today I'm going to show you a fun a little turkey design for the upcoming Thanksgiving holiday. What I have on this nail right now is two coats of this pure ice color. It's called Yellow Polka. Here's the bottle. And I'm going to be stamping using some Bundle Monster plates. First I'm going to use, this is from the original Bundle Monster set. It's plate number BM03 and we're going to use this kind of starburst flower right here. I'm going to stamp that using this brown color from Sally Hansen Instadry. It's called Coco A Go Go. And I'm going to apply polish to half of the image. If you can see that there. Okay, then I'm going to scrape away from the unpolished side so I only get half an image. See? And then I'm going to stamp that across the center top of the nail. Okay? And then I'm going to drop some of that cocoa polish on the plate. And using a dotting tool, this is the largest of the set of dotting tools that I have. Um, so you want to use a large dot. And I'm going to place a large dot at the base, a little bit below the base of where that half stamped image is, okay? And I'm going to slowly kind of tap and drag so that I end up with somewhat of a pear-shaped type image, okay? That's going to be his little body, see? Then I have to let his body kind of dry a little bit before I can add any further details to that. Um, I'm going to be taking this color from Color Club. It's called Charity Ball. And I'm going to put a little bit of that on the plate. Using a just an average size, small to average size dot dotting tool, I'm going to just fill in the open leaves with this sort of wonderfully fall rusty color. And I'm just basically tapping and dragging these in. So you don't need special paint brushes or anything like that, okay? Filling those in, and if you like, maybe just along the base I might just add a small dot to where those two little wisps sort of poke out, and maybe here in between. To kind of just fill it in so he doesn't look like he's got bald tail feathers. <laughs> Next I'm going to use this orange color from Finger Paints. It's called Tangerine Tint. using the pointy side, which is the smallest dotting tool, or a toothpick, because this is nice and, and pointy, I'm going to give him two little legs. Okay, so I'm going to just kind of tap and drag, give him two little stick legs. I'm not going to go crazy with detailed feet or anything. And then I sort of wipe these off on the paper towel in between. Then, using the same yellow, and that same pointy dotting tool, I'm going to make the tiniest little yellow dots I can possibly make for little eyes, okay? So I'm going to be... Oop, and I'm almost out of frame here. It's really hard to do this. There we go. So he's got two little eyes. And now, wiping off the yellow, going back in with more orange. I'm going to go between those eyes and create his little beak and just sort of drag it down so he has this cute little orange beak, okay? And that's pretty much your turkey. So then what we're going to do to finish off this, this design is I'm going to go in with this Bundle Monster plate number BM11. I'm going to use this sort of leafy looking pattern here. And I'm going to stamp that with the Color Club Charity Ball. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to stamp that along the bottom of this nail. I'm sorry, i got to like turn this over. So now he looks like he is standing on some leaves rather than standing in mid-air. <laughs> We're going to just follow that up with some top coat. Okay, oops, let me tap the little ends there. He has some wispy ends sticking off here. Okay. And 
trying very much not to touch or press too hard when I put this top coat on because I don't want to smear him because I didn't give him a whole lot of time to dry. I'm just going to add some top coat over that so it's nice and smooth. And there you have a little turkey for your fall Thanksgiving holiday. That's all there is to it. So I hope you like it. And for a mani, I might even do that. I would probably just do that on my ring finger and then maybe do the rest of my nails in a brown or that, that um, rusty color to kind of make this an accent nail. But you could do it on all of them too. Just uh, it's up to you. So hope you like it. And hope you guys have a good holiday. And I'll see you next time. Bye.